Hi, this is Newell with Umax. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Einscan H2, a major upgrade to its predecessor, the Einscan H. One area in which it's been upgraded is its 5 megapixel texture capturing camera down here in the, the bottom. Uh, its predecessor, the Einscan H, only had a 1 megapixel texture capturing camera. Up here at the top, we've got uh, three Vassell infrared projectors. So obviously with the scanner, you can capture data in both white light mode um, or in infrared. Uh, with infrared, you'd want to be capturing large scenes. You'd want to be capturing people, black surfaces, shiny surfaces, things that white light mode just won't really let you capture. With white light mode, however, you're going to have a higher level of accuracy. Um, you're going to be able to capture texture detail on a level that, that you might not be able to capture with infrared mode. So just something to keep in mind when you're in the Xscan H software and you're choosing which mode you want to start your project in. A lot of work's been done under the hood. Um, it's got a phenomenally large field of vision. Um, it's also got an adjustable working distance. So if you're more comfortable working at this distance, for example, while, while you're scanning, you can set your field up so that you're working at this distance within the I scan or within the uh, X scan H software. If you're more comfortable working like I am at a further distance and capturing a lot of detail and a lot of data all at once, you can set up your working area so that you're working more like this, which is pretty amazing. So we're going to be doing three quick demonstrations. Uh, the first one is going to be Noah's Ark. Um, you can see here, but there's a lot of detail in this object. Lots of little nooks and crannies and little hidden spaces. Lots of little characters. Um, we're going to be scanning this guy in white light mode. And then we're also going to scan this toilet spigot. Um, and we'll be scanning this also in white light mode, just so that you can see the amount of accuracy that it's able to pick up. Uh, and then a little bit later on, we're going to be scanning in infrared mode our uh, technical technical director, um, a live human being. Uh, so you'll be able to see how well it captures those details. Um, another another cool thing to note about the Einscan H2 is that it's eye friendly. So whether you're working in infrared mode, whether you're working in white light mode, uh, you don't have to worry personally about your own eyes and you also don't have to worry about the eyes of whomever you happen to be scanning. Let's go ahead and start with Noah's Ark. We're going to be doing this one in white light mode with texture capturing. Um, show off the Einscan H2's abilities to capture paint, capture texture, capture a ton of little detail. Let's get to it. Next, we're going to scan this toilet spigot. The best method that I found was to actually have the 3D markers on the toilet spigot itself so that the Einscan H2 could pick up areas that otherwise might be difficult for it to scan. All right, here we go. All right, so we're going to go ahead and jump into scanning our technical engineer, Seth, has graciously agreed to do this for us. To uh, start off, we're going to come over here to the Xscan software and click on IR mode. And again, keep in mind that uh, the light that's going to emanate from this is eye friendly. We're going to switch over to portrait mode uh, features. I think features is okay, yeah? Yeah, it should yeah. be. There's features and there's texture. I mean, you could, do you, you, you want to do a texture? Yeah, 
Okay, yeah, let's do texture. Or we could do a uh, hybrid. Oh, hybrid? Okay. Be best, yeah. That's why he's the technical engineer. Yeah, I would be best. That way we show off uh, texture scanning capabilities as well as the uh, regular scanning capabilities. Sounds good to me. All right, let's get to it. For more information, you can visit us at umax.com. Uh, feel free to drop us an email at info at umax.com. We have a, uh, a huge catalog on our website. This one's great for the applications that I just showed you for a wide array of applications. Whether you're a healthcare professional that needs to, to scan somebody who's been injured, you're a designer and you want to take a, a prop into, into a game or something like that, um, and you don't want to spend hours and hours creating it yourself, you know, here to be able to just scan the object, do some quick retopology and insert it. Or maybe you're just coming up with prototypes for something, you know, and you want to base it off of real life objects. So the Einscan H2 is going to allow you to rapidly do that. This guy can take in a lot of detail all at once, which is incredible. Um, so again, if you're, if you're interested, if you'd like to know more, feel free to reach out to us, info at umax.com. If this video was helpful, if you liked the content that you saw and you'd like to see more, uh, please hit like and subscribe. If you have any comments, please feel free to leave them in the comment section below. See you next time.